Okay, y'all. These are the sweetest people that bring your groceries out to your car. I mean, totally adorable. And when you come like on Tuesday or Wednesday or Thursday, very few people here. Now, I want to tell y'all, and this may not be a good thing, and you know you can be honest with me, I'm a tough old bird and I can take it. Um, see, not going inside to Walmart prevents me from buying these big buckets of hot pink petunias. Now, I'm letting all these people drive in front of me, I mean walk in front of me, that I really wouldn't have to because they're kind of far down there, but it gives me a chance to look at all these flowers. I love them, love them, love them. Now, how I maximize my shopping on Amazon, and every one of y'all that has been with me for any time at all, oh, that lady looks so cute. But she must be hotter than all get out. She had on a cute little black and white dress with black stockings. Oh, oh, oh no. Those will give you a yeast infection, y'all. Trust me, I know. Anyway, um, you know I'm a shopaholic. And when you have absolutely no money, now, that's very helpful. But when you have some extra money, Mm. Anyway, what I have done is purchase things off of Amazon and um, some of them, you have two alternatives really, well three, but I'm going to tell you about two and you're probably familiar with them. Yeah, and that stupid man needs to be paying his people more. There is no doubt about that. But anyway, um, no strawberry shake, Deborah. Oh my gosh, I want one so bad, y'all. I'm not doing it. Anyway, God bless America. What was I talking about? Oh, Amazon. You can have your return sent back to your original card that you use, or you can have it uh, refunded to an Amazon gift card. So, I have had some return to an Amazon gift card. Now, since I am also a shopaholic and the queen of returns, oh yeah, I have more than one bad habit, it works out in such a way for me, for instance, I just ordered a, an extra small uh, kitty pad to put on top of Lily's new perch. She loves it. I put it up too high, I lowered it, and now it's too low and it's crooked. So I'm gonna give it one more shot. Anyway, um, I ordered that. Didn't cost me anything, because I had a gift card. Then I ordered a bird feeder seed catcher tray. Didn't cost me anything. It's like having the Amazon gift cards are like having uh, a credit balance. And so, um, now I also bought a tension rod to go across behind my uh, couch bed, chair bed. And I'll show y'all that and what I'm doing with that someday. But anyway, it didn't work the way I wanted it to. The diameter was just 
an inch thick for, you know, lightweight curtains, that's kind of overkill. So, anyway, um, I returned that and I ordered two matching ones that will work much better. They're identical. And, um, didn't cost me any extra money. So, it, it, now, unless it was something big, and I'm done with my big stuff, y'all. I'm done with my big stuff. I have my chair sleeper. Um, it's not very comfortable to sit on. No sleeper sofa I have ever sat on has been comfortable unless it was one that was just about worn out but it's okay I don't spend a tremendous amount of time um, sitting so it's it's fine I'm having a little bit of problem with Lily because she when I put it back up into the bed mode she likes to tear around the room and she has pulled some threads on it and I tell her no when I'm in there sometimes I'm not there with her in fact when I leave and I'm gonna be gone for a while I shut her out of my room I do I got some double-sided kitty tape that I'm gonna put on the arms and the side over there by the bathroom where she spends most of her time. And I hope that's gonna kind of deter her. But we know she will nap on tinfoil, so I don't know, I'm gonna try it. So anyway, the Amazon thing, now it's like, unless I just went, you know, bananas, um, have a little credit balance and then of course every single thing I get is not going to be a hit but if I do that then it's not like I'm spending new money I'm spending old money <laughs> Y'all, now, how is that for justification, right? Oh, yeah. I can justify anything. But, y'all, my whole life, because I have been, you know, with ADHD and, um, and part of that is having certain traits, and luckily, uh, spending money was probably the lesser of the evils. And um, so, I have always shopped. Especially when I was married and I had a home. You know, I'm a nester. I like to make things nice and comfortable and cozy. And so, um, but I was also the queen of returns. I would buy stuff and then I would get it home and I would feel so guilty and I would take it back. And I remember one time when I was married to my last husband. What is that? 